we've featured brilliant contenders for the ITV Feel Good Factor Award. They're being very good, they're being very quiet in the corner. Four extraordinary people who go the extra mile to keep others fit and healthy. You sent in your nominations, a panel of experts drew up a shortlist. And this evening we are going to reveal the winner, someone who will now represent London at the Pride of Britain Awards next month. There's only one winner indeed. Kevin, it was a difficult decision, wasn't it? It was a difficult decision. You know, Katie Derren looks quiet and mild-mannered, but she was quite ferocious, so we all had to come to an amicable decision, and we raised that, and there's one winner. There certainly is, and he's just over here. The soccer might give it away. It's Andrew Amir's Morrison, but he doesn't know yet. He thinks he still could be a runner-up. Andrew, we've got something to tell you. In fact, Kevin has got something to tell you. Hello, sir. OK, there's... There's good news and bad news with all competitions, and there is bad news today. Okay. But that bad news is not for you because you're the winner! Yeah! Yeah! I knew that would happen. Yeah! Andrew! Andrew! Oh, Andrew! <laughs> What a reception! You must yeah, be absolutely thrilled. Flabbergasted would be the word. Uh, we are very more than thrilled, but it's all about these guys. These are the guys that put the effort in yeah. and put the work in, so uh, we're, all, we're accepting it together, right? Yeah! yeah. And let's, let's have a little look at some of their tricks. We've got some of them just over there who are doing all their Pelés and Maradonas and Ronaldos. You must be so pleased with all the things that you've taught them that they can now do that they couldn't before. Yeah, this, it, takes, it takes a while uh, and we, we really have to, you know, work on their confidence and, uh, you know, their agility and their coordination. Uh, so, yeah, but we, it shows that, you know, if you put the effort in and you spend the time practising, that it's, you know, anybody and everyone can do this. Good stuff. And where's young Dylan? Dylan, you absolutely adore Andrew, don't you? Tell me, what's he done for you? Um, he's gave us that bit extra. That bit extra? Yep. Lucky you. Well, listen, Kevin, it wasn't a diff an easy decision, was it? It was a difficult one. Why, Andrew? I, I think, you know, in a sea of negativity, it's nice to see beacons of positivity, and Andrew was a beacon of positivity. And not only that, in football, where there is so much negativity, Andrew just shone out, head and shoulders above the rest. Absolutely. And what happens next for him? Well, he gets to go to the Daily Mirror Pride of Britain Awards, and then he gets to go to 10 Downing Street and meet the Prime Minister. Woo! Yeah. Well done. Show, doesn't it, that under every grey flyover there is a silver lining? I'm going to leave you with the uh, street samba chant after three guys. Three, two, one. Samba! 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 samba.